So my current passion is really to build bridge to move medical research forward. I think there have been exciting advances over the last years, but people don't realize that in order to bring new medicines to patients, you need more than scientific research. You have also to consider regulatory aspects. You, you have to make sure that the drugs will um, be affordable by patients, by society. So it means that you have to extend the scope of the research to economics, to ethics. And also, this is not only about drugs, it's also about medical devices. It's about using big data. So it means that you have really to bring together different disciplines, different expertise, to really translate the progress of research into new therapies for patients. In order to bridge the gap I was just uh, describing, I think that what is essential is to start by educating a new generation of healthcare professionals. And for this, we will launch early next year a unique education program in which we will have uh, in the audience students from six different faculties, for example, medicine, pharmacy, public health, but also economics, but also law, also the, from the engineering school. And the idea is that these students would be together to listen to renowned speakers. And they will be a part in which the student themselves will, ha will have to work together across their respective disciplines to solve problems or to propose solutions to problems in healthcare. Well, the other part is to do research on you know, key questions related, for example, to patient access. How do you make sure that you know, new treatment, let's say against hepatitis C, are available to patients across the world? Um, question related to vaccine coverage, which is a major issue. How do you work to make sure that you know vaccines are used the way they should be against again uh, across the world? And also, we will have a research conducted by economists on how to reorganize industries in order to have them more engaged in collaborative efforts.